Strictly Come Dancing returns for the musical's special this weekend and the Glitter Ball Trophy is almost within touching distance. Some frontrunners are starting to stand out but it could be anyone's game as the finale approaches. Professional dancer Gary Edwards suggested Shirley Ballas needs to offer more constructive criticism to some couples. Last week's Strictly saw actor Will Miller and cameraman Hamza Yassin top the leaderboard with scores in the high 30s. Wildlife fanatic Hamza wowed judges Shirley and Matsi Mabuse with his Argentine tango to leave air tango by Bond. However, both Anton Dubeka and Craig Revel Horwood pointed out errors in his leg action and footwork. Anton described the star's bottom half as looking like he played center forward for Bradford City. Dance expert Gary Edwards told Express. UK he was growing frustrated with the judges scoring. He said, if you'd have seen us watching we would have had to turn the volume down on our language. I thought the judges were so far off the mark this week, I'm so frustrated it's not even funny. Hamza has always had great balance but the guys were right, if that's a 10 then I should give up judging. Never in a million years was that a 10. He had great leadership and strength but his feet and legs were absolutely awful. Look at what direction his toes were pointing in, they point inwards and it's so frustrating. Gary said he has agreed with Craig and Anton a lot more than Shirley and Motsi. He added, I just don't understand why they can't criticize, everything seems to be good and nice. That's not helping the celebrities, obviously they don't want bad things to be said but they need to learn as well. The two guys are right, in my opinion, 90% of the time. He also suggested actor Will Malore's unique Charleston was overscored due to its lack of content. Gary added, Will had great entertainment value but the Charleston content was very lacking. I had them down as 8 out of 10, Therese no way I would have gone a 10 on that so for me it was overmarked. At the moment those marks are punching above where he should be for me. The professional dancer fears the judges' scores will lead the audience to believe the dances are being judged on entertainment value alone. He said, for me to say Craig was the one I agreed with the most. Shirley and Motsi are on a different planet to me. I don't know what they are watching. What that does mean is the audience will be voting more for the entertainment. If the judges don't say Hamza's feet were awful, as far as the audience is concerned they are only looking at the entertainment. Craig Revel Horwood came to Anton's defense, saying, I totally agree with Anton. It was extremely messy. I felt like you'd only concentrated really on the top half, which worked brilliantly, and if I was going to love any part of the dance, it was the top half. Strictly Come Dancing returns to BBC One on Friday at 8pm.